McGregor is being investigated for a physical altercation with a lady aboard his boat in Ibiza in July 2022. According to the story, the alleged victim was aboard McGregor's yacht following his birthday celebration at Ocean Beach Club in Ibiza on July 16. She claimed to know McGregor because they both grew up in the same Dublin neighborhood. She said in her statement that she went to McGregor's boat with him and others after drinking in the club's VIP section with them. She claimed that after that, he began to make fun of her appearance, kicked her in the stomach, punched her, and threatened to drown her. In her statement to police, the woman said that she jumped off the boat, which was at the time close to the island of Formentera, to escape McGregor. A Red Cross boat eventually brought her back to land. According to a different report from Spain's Ultima Ora, the alleged victim first claimed that McGregor had assaulted her, but when Spain's civil guard officers questioned her, she refused to name McGregor as the perpetrator and said that she only wanted to go back to Ireland. But after returning home, she immediately lodged a police report in Ireland. An investigation is now ongoing into the alleged occurrence. At UFC 283, Jamal Hill defeated former champion Glover Teixeira with a dominant performance to win the vacant light heavyweight championship. Yuri, who lost the belt in November due to a shoulder injury, delivered a warning to the new champion shortly after the contest, writing, Congratulations, I'm coming. Yuri stated on the MMA Hour that his shoulder recuperation is doing better than anticipated and that he hopes to be ready to fight again this summer. I think I can be back in July or August, something like that. Six or seven months, something like that. Because I don't want the fastest way back just to fight. I know this is not the best attitude. I want to be sure that my body works for 200%. I was a little bit surprised by Glover Teixeira's performance. His energy and his speed. He was so slow. He was a little bit slow. Amazing work from Jamal. He did everything right. So congratulations to him, and I'm looking forward for him. I thought Glover had big chance to win, especially in Rio with the home crowd. Everything worked in this event for him, so I'm a little bit surprised by that, but that's good. A good step for light heavyweight, and I'm happy for that. I'm happy for this result because Jamal Hill is a young guy, he's dangerous, and I like to have before me somebody like him, who will challenge me. I'm looking forward to starting training.